Yo, YouTube, what is up? It is Royton Heed, back to watch more SpongeBob SquarePants. Woo! Uh, saw the first episode a couple of days ago. It is what it is, you know. Uh, it's definitely a stoner cartoon, in my opinion. I've only seen the first episode, I gotta see more of it, but I've heard from the, you know, the woodwork that's, it's, it's for stoners. <laughs> and uh, uh, the kids love it too, man. I can see why the kids, you know, the kids love this shit. It's kind of, it's kind of sad though, man. Your boy, like, fam, I've been off the Reaper for like over a month now, so it's like, <laughs> you know, I'm not trying to get back on the reefer to enjoy this shit. I mean, hey, you don't need drugs to enjoy things out there, guys. You can enjoy things out there sober, man. You know what? Come on, man. We don't need any of that. But, yo, you know what? I'm still going to go with it. I'm, I'm going to have the most fun as I can with it. I have optimism in my blood and in my veins, and I'm ready to just do this, all right? Let's, let's just have fun with it, guys. Thank you all for being here. I love and appreciate all of you guys. If you guys really like these SpongeBob SquarePants, <laughs> SpongeBob SquarePants reactions, please, you know, hit that bell for notification, you know, like, comment, subscribe, all that helps. And uh, if you just wanna sit there and be lazy and just watch, hey man, do that too, bro. Just, you know, stick around for me. It, it means a lot back here. And sis, I keep saying bros, you know, there's sisters out there too. I'm sure there's a good amount of females out there still watching me. I mean, I hope. I hope. <laughs> oh, who is that? He has come to fuck with my shit. What up, buddy boy? What's up? What do you need? What up? What do you need? Oh, wow. Princess is here, too. It's amazing. Both of you guys are here. Uh, what do y'all need? You guys were quiet for so long, man. It's like I, I just I felt like you guys were just out there just, you know, being quiet. Now you guys are not quiet anymore. All right. Uh, what do we need? What, what, what are we trying to do, guys? What, what are we trying to do, guys? We need a... Uh, Either you guys want to stick around and watch the SpongeBob with me, or what are you trying to do? I, th I think you're trying to do something, but I'm just letting you know that's not going to happen. Like, we're not going to go outside. We were just outside. Literally, I took you to fucking Marat Park, kid. You went fucking ham. You stop that shit, Vincent. God damn it, you stop that shit. <laughs> I can't hear you. Oh, who, who lives in a pineapple under the sea? SpongeBob SquarePants. Oh, whoops. Wait a minute. Fuck that up. SquarePants. SpongeBob SquarePants. SpongeBob SquarePants. SpongeBob SquarePants. SpongeBob SquarePants. Yo, check it out, man. I wear my Nickelodeon shirt, man. You represent, you know, SpongeBob ain't on here, but, you know, I got, like, you know, Ren Stimpy, you know. I mean, you know, I got, you know, Ren, you know, I got Chucky, you know. Yeah, I got Ren and Stimpy, we've been both on here, man, yeah. Well, I don't know what the name is, storyboard, whatever, let's do this. Written by Ineo, let's do it. This piece. <laughs> it's, it's sort of villain shit. All loud as fuck. That's the fuck. So he can be loud and he can't be loud? What kind of shit is that? Bro, fucking start hammering that shit in, cuz. Hell yeah. Twenty-five cents? Is that you know, fuck it. I mean that sounds reasonable to me, man. <laughs> oh man, you suck at it, bro. Come on, man. Just gotta He's trying. He's trying. Fam is trying. And he's still going. He's got more air than I do. <laughs> Bro, he's a rip. He's a rip. He's, he's going to charge. That's how he gets him, right? He's got a... Oh, damn, crazy. That's, no, that's, that's not the way to make a bubble, man. Come on, man. That's a little bit too much. But if that really is a secret to make uh, duck bubbles or cube bubbles. Oh, wow. He's killing it with the bubbles, cuz. Like, thanks. Dude, he made a fucking tugboat. He can do some special work with his, with his lungs, man. 
he's not happy. <laughs> it's a giraffe. It's a giraffe. How the fuck is it fitting in there like hot? Why didn't it pop? Oh man, Squidward's gonna be. Oh fuck that, dude. He's not happy about that shit. <laughs> Yeah, he's been around. Three times. He had that, the fam had to add that pelvis, pelvic thrust in there, right? He's a bitch. Squidward is that, is that one shit he's gonna go blow on himself now, watch. Squidward's a little dick. Oh, he got his ass! We also offer lessons for beginners. Beginners. Oh, he got him! Oh, he got his ass! He got him, dude! Watch and listen. He's not gonna be able to do it! <laughs> oh, that's great. Good job, buddy. Remember, you gotta, you know, you gotta spin, you gotta do it, you gotta go round and round. He's about to spend all his money here. Oh my god! Remember the technique, and then step back. Yo, dude, this is a cloud. He just got, he just. <laughs> Scribber's an idiot. The pelvic woo. <laughs> oh man, he's about to fucking. You gotta go around, around like that, bro. This all about technique. technique. Yo, check the technique. Pelvic thrust. And then spin. Round and round. Little of that. Oh, shit. That's how you do it. That's really how you do it, dude. Damn, fam. Damn, fam. Alright. <laughs> it's good, it's good, it's good, it's good, it's good. Yo, check the technique. What a dick. Hey, man. Give credit where credit's due. Oh, man. Yo, SpongeBob is great, dude. <laughs> he, just, he just got his ass, bro. And he made him feel good. <laughs> I'm with it, dude. I'm with it. This is a good episode. <laughs> Uh-oh. Is that the bubble he just fucking made? What happened to it? And he's blowing inside of it. Stop making it better. Is this house going to come crashing down now? <laughs> that, that was good. That was a good one. That was a really good one. What was I don't even know what that was called. This one's called Rip Pants. Okay. Goo Lagoon. Isn't that a song? It's a nectar song. Well, I think it's it, it's probably one of the songs you borrowed. I mean, it's a good song though. Goo Lagoon. Who am I? Hey, yeah, this is this is good, dude. It's, yeah, it's great. It's great. Hey, Fuck Larry. Yo, fuck Larry. Fuck Larry. I don't, I don't fucking like Larry already. SpongeBob, show these meatheads who's boss. Fuck this guy. <laughs> man, Sandy's strong, man. <clears throat> Got this, bro. He got you, I realize he's just a sponge, man. You got no fucking muscle. Hey, man, it happens. 
He's a sponge, bro. You can't hit it. <coughs> he did it again. <laughs> oh, he's he's. So now you gotta be the comedian. The joke's getting old now, though. I guess they think it's fucking hilarious. I would get weird out if some dude came up to me and showed me this shit. I'd probably throw something at him. Fuck you, Larry. The joke's getting old now. He's gonna... <clears throat> He's gonna do my pants joke again. It's gonna be like, yeah. <clears throat> Me as the audience is going, oh my god, stop. I know, man. It's fine. They buried him in the sand and forgot me. What happened to you? I lost my best friend. Oh. <laughs> they buried him in the sand and forgot. My pad. Jesus, man, you still ripping his pants? Big Larry came out just to put him down. Okay. <laughs> All right. He's a good voice. Yeah. Santa, you buns. Yes. Yes. Yo, that's actually that. That shit was good. That was that was a song. Okay. Be yourself. He's right. At, hey, the message in there is right. Be yourself, fam. At the end of the day, that's all you got, right? Fuck you, Larry. Sign my pants. Yeah, absolutely, buddy. Never mind. You're a nice guy. Yo, fan, th this is definitely not a kid's show, man. That's just, I mean, straight up, like... And how old will people watching this shit? I mean, like, yo, I used to watch Ren and Stimpy, though, man. Ren and Stimpy was definitely not a kid's show. Like, Ren and Stimpy was definitely, definitely not a kid's show at all whatsoever. Uh, alright, let's just, uh, you know, with this, I mean, I'm not gonna go in depth with it, because it's, it's just, I, I mean, I can, if you want me to, but just give my thoughts more than anything. Uh, that first episode was fucking hilarious. That shit was just hilarious. Uh, Spongebob, definitely, he, like, he's good at being Spongebob, man. He, he, he basically conned that man, bro. He literally talked right into that shit. He kept, so we kept going, who's going to pay 25 cents for this? Who's going to pay 25 cents for this? And then Squidward ended up paying, like, I think, like, a buck 50 for the whole entire fucking thing, man. Like, that shit, that, that, that was hilarious. That was so well done. I love that. But that was so funny, dude. All of it. Like, the beginning to all of it. Like, you know, him just pissing him off with the, with the, with the sound. And Squidward is just a dick. I mean, I'm sure we, the character grows on you eventually, but he's just, like, like, fuck you, dude, you know? He's like, come on, man. And he's always trying to, like, you know, and Spongebob does a really good job, I feel like, of just trying to, like, make him feel important also. You know, like, he's just, or he's just being himself, man. But, yeah, that was great. His whole little maneuver that he did, you gotta spin it around and around, do this and that. You gotta check the technique. <laughs> it was well done. And, and at the end, you know, him having Squidward believe that, you know, it was, he didn't need his help, that was, that was very big of Spongebob. I realized, if anything, Spongebob is, very big like he doesn't you know he doesn't fuck with the bullshit i feel like right i feel like he's like if anything he's really a g like straight up like except for the second episode the second episode he kind of got annoying he was just like just replaying the same joke but i kind of understand you know a little bit on you know all that because hey man when you're trying to impress somebody trust me i've been there guys trying to impress a girl or impress anybody at all you know or try to be like the alpha because Bro, all my life, obviously, I've been like, you know, the shorter guy, and uh, I've had to deal with a lot of big muscle heads. I'm not gonna, it's just, yeah, I mean, you just deal with them. As, as you know, even even as a regular, you deal with muscle heads. You deal with the guys that try to like impress the girl, and you're you're like, you're sitting there, you're just like, damn, man. It's like, what do I do? You know, like, do I, you know, and the guys like me, 
you know, we resort to comedy. Comedy helps out a lot, you know. Being the funny guy helps out too. So uh, that's what, you know, guys like SpongeBob do. We, we uh, or like me, whatever, you know, the, we, we go out, we, we woo the women with comedy, we woo the women with being ourselves, you know, and uh, that's, that's usually what's worked, you know, I mean, shit. Uh, yeah, man, and I guess that advice can go to anybody out there, guys, just be yourself at the end of the day, because uh, there are way too many copies in this fucking world, being original. It, it, it is kind of crazy, like, I just feel like people try to, uh, there's a lot of jocks, they, they jock off motherfuckers, you know? Hey, man, but then, you know, Personally, for me, when I when I see anybody jock off me or anything like that, I kind of, it's a, it's a compliment, you know. Hey, it is what it is, man. You know. So uh, at the end of the day, listen to SpongeBob what he said. Be yourself. Be true to who you are, and uh, things will work out, man. You'll be friends with someone like Sally, right? And uh, also, hey, man, be humble, motherfucker, too, man. Be humble. You know, keep your know how to play the game too bro because he spongebob knows how to play the game bro he played squidward bro he had patrick come out and give him the fake money like that was a straight up hustle bro he hustled the shit out of that man that was a hustle he hustled him for real uh but yeah i think that's it that's all i got for y'all man uh yeah catch me on the next one and uh yeah i'll see y'all there peace Yo, fam, thank you for watching this episode of Spongebob with me. It means the world back here. I'll see you guys in the next one. Hope the laughs are good. Peace.